done it from time to time. Just have a bit of... Oh! So is he a boxer now? No, he's still Tyron Woodley is still not a boxer. I don't care what what you want to talk about, man. Tyron Woodley is an MMA fighter. So stand up game in boxing is way different than MMA fighting, grappling to the ground and all that type of stuff. It's a totally different thing. And I was I was funny because I was at a I was at a, a, a party the other night. And uh, before the COVID protocols were put into place, uh, Doug Ford, and we were talking. I was talking to a guy who who does Muay Thai, and he said that he took up boxing, right? And he thought that he was going to go into boxing, and because the guy that he was boxing had only been boxing for three years, and he had six or seven years of Muay Thai experience. Muay Thai. So he- <laughs> oh, say it again. Muay Thai. Chop suey. Okay, got it. So he had more experience in this guy. So he went into the ring thinking, you know, I'm going to be able to, to destroy this man. And he goes, he caught about five punches within a few seconds and didn't even see any of them coming, just straight jabs to the face. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a different game, man. It's a different game, but it, it it's still a good knockout. It's still a good knockout. Really? We're still there? What do you mean still? Still where? Still, no, he's not a boxer. Doug, he has to fight a boxer. And you know what? A lot of people are saying Tyron Woodley took extra money to get knocked out. Oh, my gosh. Hey, it's what, it's what people are talking about. You may not believe it. Because you know what you, you sound know like? Nothing sound, about boxing. You sound like, you sound like one of those. Um, uh, a genius. That's who no, I sound like. Definitely not. But you sound like one of those black guys who can't admit to how great Eminem is as a rapper only because he's white. That's what you sound like. No. Meanwhile, meanwhile, Eminem is still getting in the booth. He's still rhyming words, just like Jake Paul is still getting into a ring and boxing. It, it's still boxing, right? Like, even, so me and you are not professional boxers, not even close. Right. Right. I mean, I might be closer than you, but that's a different story. But the <laughs> point is, is like we could both oh, get into God. a ring and we could box. Are people going to look at us and say they're not boxing? They're playing hockey or table tennis. It's right. boxing. Right. So when Do people scare. are so hold on. So when people are saying that he's not a boxer, we could go into a ring and be boxing. And people would have to say they may not call us boxers when we exit the ring. Hell, they may not even call us boxers while we're boxing, but we're still boxing. Therefore, at that time, we're boxers. We're not uh, custodians. We're not right. principals because we're boxing. So we're boxers. So the argument should be, and it might be, maybe I'm missing it. Is he a professional boxer? I've never heard it worded that way. Because in that case, I would say no. But just as a general description, yeah, he's a boxer. Okay, so before I do anything, I just want to know, Deuce Gang, you know, a boxing match between between my guy and, and this guy over here. Who who's winning the fight? Leave it in the comments. Let me know who you think is winning uh, in a boxing match between us two. First of all, and let me let me respond to what you're saying by can't by let saying, it go, eh? Can't let it let go. me respond. <laughs> shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> let me let me respond. Let me respond to what you're saying by by saying it like this. Okay, so I get what you're saying. Yes, if I get into a ring and we both put on boxing gloves, me and you are fighting in a boxing match, and we are fighting against each other in a boxing ring. We have boxing gloves. We are boxing, right? That does not make us boxers. We are two guys in the ring that are simply engaged in the sport of, of boxing. That would be like saying somebody who picks up a basketball and just starts dribbling is an NBA player. No, no, it doesn't see, work see, like that. See, you, you, you took my response and flipped it to something totally different. I Socrates I said, did, dog. No, I, I said, it. I said that it makes him a boxer. 
just like you said, oh, if somebody picks up a ball and starts dribbling, they're in the NBA. I said boxer. I didn't say professional boxer. I said boxer. Just like if somebody picks up a basketball and starts dribbling, one could say that they're a basketball player. I didn't say anything that they could play in the NBA. Levels to this. Levels. I think you somebody went, picking up from. I think somebody who's been so professional. Nope, like nope, that. nope. That's what because you Because I'm saying somebody who just picks up a basketball and starts playing basketball is not a basketball player. There's somebody who's engaged in the in in the sport of basketball. Once they start practicing and learning the sport, yeah, then they become a basketball player in so my can, mind. So That's we, what I'm we saying. Not, so wait a second. Could we not apply that to Jake Paul? If we, if practicing? we, okay. So if we, if we, if we, if we're, if we're <laughs> learning if we're, the sport, can he we not is. apply no, that he to is. him? No, absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. But when he's fighting, when he's fighting professional level, okay. You know what? You're right. You're right on that aspect. Professional he's level. But okay, who's so no fighting a professional level? To your point. Um, Tyron Woodley is not a professional boxer. So who said right. it's a professional level? He's just boxing. That's it. But people are trying to say when 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 the question is asked, is he a boxer now? You're not just asking me, does he box every now and then in like the county, the county rec center? That question to me sounds like, okay, can we call him a professional now? Because he's five and oh, he's beating up five dudes. These guys have boxing experience as well. Da, 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 da. That's how I took the question. And most times when people ask the question, is he a boxer now? That's what they're referring to. Is he a professional boxer? Because is he somebody who is a boxer and, and been training? Yes, that's obvious. I'm not denying that. I don't want to take that away from him. He definitely has more experience in the sport of boxing than everybody else that he fought. That's the problem that I have. How do you not end up beating somebody when you have more experience than them? You should. You should. This is not this is not one of those sports where where the young guys are going to come in and just take over. This is one of those sports where experience can actually win you games. A la Floyd Money Mayweather. That's why he can still fight in his in his 40s against people and and make them look stupid because it's experience. He fought against what's his name? Logan Paul. Made him look dumb. Logan Paul might have got some shots off, but Floyd Mayweather shows you the difference between a boxer. Professional and a bo boxer. Okay, whatever, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, though. You know I what do I'm know saying. what you're saying. You because probably... you knew I wasn't going to use the word professional, so you snuck it in there well, for it's me. Not even about I didn't want to use no, it. It's don't, a, it's... Don't, don't contribute to my sentences, okay? It, I'm perfectly first of all, fine. It is about what people are i understand the conversation that's being had and of course it's implied when they say oh is he a boxer now meaning is he a professional i understand what people imply when they say that and they're, they're talking about him i'm just saying generally speaking you cannot call him a boxer he might be a novice he might be intermediate i didn't say anything about him being a professional that's like all these little kids in there in, if they still have sports in school anyways, uh, in their seven and eight, maybe K to six who are on the basketball team. Are you going to look at them and say you're not basketball <laughs> player when you're practicing? And crush their, and, just crush their dreams. Exactly, crush their dreams. Y'all exactly. ain't no basketball players. I'd be the coach. I'd be like, y'all ain't no basketball players. Y'all just some little kids dribbling. All right. Throwing, throwing basketballs went, went from at six. Dribbling to dribbling. Throwing basketballs at six-year-olds' heads. You know how hard a basketball talking. is? see coach carter we ain't see coach carter you're about to see coach my guy soon but yo watch the video again no seriously watch the video again oh, because the, i know we wanted to dismiss this quickly because you don't like it but it kind of looked like tyron woodley walked into the punch did he get knocked out he definitely got knocked out for real but he kind of walked into the punch and tyron woodley comes off as just a guy to me last words who doesn't really have much dignity and will do what he wants to do for the check that's why he got the tattoo. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know, man. I don't know. I'm not trying to discredit Jake Paul's record or whatever I'm saying, but I watched that video a few times. And listen, the man took two steps towards the punch, gave Paul time to, to wind up. And hey, it looks sketchy to me. That's all I'm saying. And I got boxing friends that said the same. All right. Well, what say you? Uh, did he walk into the punch? Is he a sellout? Shout out, shout out to Tristan Brooks, by the way. Leave it in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe. You too, Tristan Brooks. Um, okay.